Hey teacher, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I think it's gonna be a fun one. Hopefully, especially to those that enjoy watching K-dramas like me. I've been watching K-dramas for years and I love some of the K-actresses outfits such as Hotel de Luna. Like seriously, do I need to even go into details for her outfits? Everything that I use wearing is just bombs. So I want to try and recreate some of the key actresses outfit and dress as them. Hmm, I know that some of the drama may be a little bit hard to recreate because my wardrobe is quite simple but Mm, we will try and see what we can do about that. So without further ado, let's get right into this video where I try to recreate these Korean actresses outfits. Yay! And by the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, go and hit the subscribe button now and like this video. Alrighty, so the very first look is obviously from Hotel de Luna because I just can't, I need to start with them. So, Ayu is always wearing like long dresses. It's either floral printed or like any extravagant print. So this is the closest I can have for a long dress and I got this from Forest Plaza and I filmed this dress on my previous video, you can totally check them out. For my shoe, I match it with a black heels because I think she's always wearing like pointed heels and this is what I got. For hairstyle wise, I tried my best to tie something similar to hers. It's just too hard to tie her hairstyle so I just roll it up and clip it on and ta-da! not the best but I tried and then I also match it with a long long earrings anything that is extra but I know this pink just doesn't suit the dress I tried I just don't have anything better to match with this dress but it's okay it's all about being unique and being extra this is technically the first outfit for Hotel de Luna Oh my god, this is the another look. <laughs> Super freaking high class vintage and I freaking love it. It's also from Hotel de Luna. What Ayu was wearing was like a full black outfit with pearls and all. And she also have like black glove but I don't have anything similar to that. So yeah, this is what I try to pair with. She's wearing like a white color bag but I only have a black one to match with her so I think it still match well yay and the heels is also the same black heels then I also try to tie the bun <laughs> it's a little bit failed but yay I tried I put on these I don't know some clip-on shit to make it look more extra like how she did on her bun and earrings that have pearls. I don't have like a pearl necklace but I do have a pearl ring that I got from Taobao. This is freaking nice. Anyway, um, I might not have a black gloves to match this whole entire outfit but I do have a kitchen gloves to <laughs> match it. Oh my god, I actually feel like this is totally a look. This is like when you're too freaking cheap and you want to wear a glove but you can't afford those expensive gloves. Just get a kitchen glove girl, it still look good. Can't help it. Okay, but seriously, I totally love this entire outfit a lot because it's a very nice outfit to wear for like a high class dinner at a high class restaurant wearing all the cheap stuff to look high class. Last 
look from Hotel de Luna. So the very last look is actually very casual and easy to match, which is denim overalls. Um the only thing is that the one that Ayu is wearing, she have like dollar signs printed on her jackets and the skirt which is super freaking extra her cap is also denim but I don't have like a denim cap so I'm matching it with a blue cap then for the back wise it's black the belt is also black I think a simple spaghetti top will match well with the jackets and the skirt then for jewellery wise I think gold or diamond works Anyway, for shoe, obviously it's just black heels or uh, sneakers, but I'm too lazy to wear them, so I'm not gonna care. This is actually overall a very casual look, but when I wear that shit, it just makes her look like a million dollars. Can't relate. I'm pretty sure I don't even need to name this drama out. Just by looking at this whole entire outfit, well, obviously it is from the Secretary Kim drama. <sighs> that drama is so iconic. I love that shit as show. But anyway, the Kim B So, which is the Secretary, she's always wearing this type of OL outfit. I actually like her outfit a lot, even though it's very simple and OL style because like her blouse is actually very nice and she always have like different type of matching colors and I freaking love it so I also want to wear something that is less monotonous kind of color so I decided to match with a purple skirt and for the back it is a blue color back and it's still kind of wrapped up with styrofoam because it's very new why is it that my camera just can't focus sometimes for heels obviously it's the same as black heels that i've been wearing for the past few outfits i don't think she actually put on any jewelries on her i don't think secretary actually have the time to do that so ears necks and fingers are mostly clean the only thing that is different is the color of your top and the skirt so for this drama, it has like the simplest outfit and it's just really very easy to recreate. They are mostly like casual streetwear fashion. The drama name is called My ID is Gangnam Beauty. It's so nice to watch guys, you should totally watch it. So what I'm wearing is a very simple t-shirt, literally any t-shirt and I match it with like a denim skirt because that's exactly what the main actress was wearing. She's wearing like a white plain t-shirt with some like wordings and all with a denim skirt. So like I said, it's really very easy to recreate their outfit. This look is from Beauty Inside and I'm actually recreating Kang Sara outfit. So she was wearing this polka dot skirt with a black crop top and like the sleeve is long and it's very puffy. Oh my god, I really love Kang Sara in that drama because she's just really pretty and savage. I can totally relate to her emotions all the time, you know. She's just really like me but actually she's a very kind person back to the outfit so i don't have a similar top as her but i try my best to match with the skirt anyway this is not exactly a skirt if you watch one of my Taobao video you will know that this is actually a dress all i did to this shit is i just fold it into half and tada it became a skirt and for the back she's actually carrying a white bag but I don't have any other white bag other than this so yeah I'm carrying this then for my hair I try to center part like her and yeah this is just the overall look so for 
the very next look this is also from the same drama but it's another actress that's wearing this outfit i think she's like the main actress or something she's wearing a blouse that is probably like a dress or a romper i have no idea what she's wearing actually but it's also printed something like this but it's more authentic obviously it's like a versace blouse or something i don't know but this is the dupe version she's also wearing like a belt to make a layer um i don't have like a thin belt so i'm wearing this this is a pleated gold chain that i got from a diy store and as for her bag she's actually carrying like a very ugly green color sling bag or something to change out that ugliness i decided to carry this small louis vuitton bag so it looks more expensive and classy than for my shoe i'm wearing this black boots in the drama she's always wearing high heel boots so this is obviously me trying to pair up with this outfit yay okay so for this look it is a very comfy yet pretty and suitable for office type of look because um you and Na apparently wear this to her work this is from touch your heart drama um the female actress was supposed to be a famous star in that drama but she became like an assistant or a secretary so she started off with wearing all the like very loud and exaggerated type of clothing and slowly she's toned down and this is one of the similar outfit that she wore in the drama she's actually wearing a pink knitted sleeve top something like this and a greeted skirt i think hers is like a-line not like bandage like this overall i just think that this is very mature looking even though it's very casual and comfy the next time if i ever get the chance to be an assistant for an attorney i would totally wear this that's quite nice right okay for this very last look i changed it up quite a little bit but i still try my best to make it as similar as possible so i'm recreating the itaewon class actress look so she's a real badass but a very smart one i don't have like red outerwear that is like this and i don't have the turtleneck long sleeve top i don't have a leopard print skirt so i just try to maybe change it out a little um instead of looking fierce it's more soft instead of the rough type of look okay i think this jacket is similar to hers except mine is pink and hers is red then for the inner wear i try my best to find something that's turtleneck okay but i really don't have so i'm wearing this mesh turtleneck top then for the skirt i just kind of find anything to really match the bottom that she's wearing so i just match it with a button-up skirt and this is the overall fit that i would totally dress in that k-drama honestly i think i still can fight in this outfit it shouldn't be an issue i think all right seizures so this is all i have for you guys in this video i hope you guys enjoy some of the outfits that i recreated for the different k-dramas i know that some of them may be a little bit different and it changed out the whole entire vibe but the point here is to have fun so as always i hope you enjoy this video and remember to subscribe to this channel like this video and follow my social media and i'll see you guys in my next video bye